here's what we're doing here. Um, I've got a twin Tempur-Pedic mattress here. It uh, happens to be the Cloud Prima uh, mattress, which is their, their starting point price-wise. Um, so what we're going to do here is I'm going to cut this mattress down from 39 inches wide to 29 inches um, because I have a customer that has a houseboat and they're, they're limited on space and the only the, the biggest platform that they could build for the bedrooms was 29 inches wide. So um, I'm going to show you how to do that right here. So first off, you unzip the bottom, this bottom cover. This unzips all the way around and it comes completely off. And then you have the top cover. It just peels right off. And you want to make sure and keep this top cover somewhere safe, somewhere clean, so you don't get it too dirty. I don't get it dirty at all, hopefully. Um, okay, so the next step is going to be to cut this uh, sort of cheesecloth material open uh, so we can actually get to the foam. So you literally just use a pair of scissors. Um, you want to make sure that you don't cut the actual foam itself. I mean, not that it really matters because we're going to cut it off anyway. But... All right, and there you have it. That's what the inside of a Tempur-Pedic mattress looks like. Okay, so you're going to need a tape measure, a marker, and a, some sort of a straight edge. So, um, what I'll do is I will measure here to here, and I'm going to measure 29 inches all the way down to make sure you have a straight cut. So, we've got 29 inches here. Okay, so uh, now we'll start cutting, and uh, one thing just to uh, remember while you're cutting is to try as best you can, it's not going to be perfect, but try as best you can to keep the knife as vertical as possible, straight up and down as possible, that way you get a good, nice, straight edge. Again, it's not going to be perfect, but I mean, you want to try to be as perfect as possible. Okay, so I've uh, finished up with the first cut, uh, and because the blade on the knife is not quite long enough to cut through and through uh, the entire mattress thickness, um, now I've got to flip the mattress over on the other side, measure it again, and do the exact same thing I just did just on the top side of the mattress. So, So we've turned the mattress over uh, to make my second cut, and I went ahead and marked up where I need to cut on this one. Um, so here we go. I'm gonna start cutting again.
what you've trimmed off, uh, what you need to trim off the edge. Uh, easy as just putting the cheesecloth back on. And like I said, there's going to be a, you know, as you can see, there's a little slack in, in the cover. But, uh, like I said, you just, uh, just kind of tuck it up underneath right there. There you go. And like I said, this side will be up on, uh, up against the wall. And once you put your sheets on it, uh, you really never, you'll never notice it's slack. So, there you go. And that's how you cut a Tempur-Pedic mattress. Have a great day.